This all happened just around four this morning. I'll show you the remnants of this crash. Uh, that car you see there primarily is a Nissan Rogue. It was struck by a BMW that's in uh, the foreground there. And we'll go ahead and show you some video from uh, just after when this happened. Police telling us at 413 this morning, they responded to a serious motor vehicle collision here at Jerome Avenue and East Fordham Road. Now, the preliminary investigation reveals the driver of that BMW operating at a high rate of speed runs through a red light here at Jerome Avenue and strikes the front of a Nissan Rogue. Now that BMW loses control and crashes into the pillar of the elevated four train which is right here at Fordham Road and Jerome Avenue. It crashes on the passenger side. Now the passenger inside that BMW was rushed to St. Barnabas Hospital and has been pronounced dead. Now, the driver of that car and four other people were removed to St. Barnabas Hospital, uh, and they are all in serious condition. But again, we believe that driver is in grave condition this morning. So for some reason, that car over there, as you see, you know, Lily was speeding, was coming up pretty fast or something like I heard like a big boom. That's it, you know what I'm saying? So I knew there was something wrong. You know what I mean? So that's what happened. And all of a sudden, you know, I guess he was trying to take a turn and all of a sudden, like, he hit the column. Boom. And you see the NYPD Highway Collision Investigation Squad lieutenant and uh, officers doing uh, the work here in this intersection, trying to piece this together uh, frame by frame. But again, this morning, we believe uh, that at this point, one person is dead uh, from this motor vehicle collision on Jerome Avenue and Fordham Road. The driver, we're told by police, uh, running a red light and smashing into another vehicle before crashing into a pillar of this four train station here at the Fordham Road stop. And that's where we're live. I'm Miles Miller. Weekend Today in New York. Back to you. Awful, awful scene. Miles, thank you for that update. Developing today, police working to identify a man's body that was found in the water in Queens. They say the decapitated body was discovered around 9 last night at 165 Avenue in Cross Bay Boulevard in Howard Beach. Fishermen in the area say this hits close to home. Once in a while, there's incidents with um, fishermen that get swept to sea which sounded like what happened, but yeah, but the decapitation was definitely something different though. Mm -hmm. Detectives now trying to figure out how the man died and that investigation also ongoing.